Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Amy and I have a shopping vlog for you today. Plus an unboxing to top it off, of course. As we all know, Chanel Ready to Wear is very, very, very expensive. But luckily, I did get this on sale. Let's unbox it first because I know you're dying to see what I got. So yes, a little hanger. Here's the proof for purchase. Super exciting. I know it looks so small. It is such a delicate little top and it's the prettiest, prettiest top. It's a very, very expensive top though, but it's the loveliest little top that I have ever laid my eyes on to reveal. I put it on the hanger so you can really see how beautiful this lovely tank top is. Really amazing that they included some of the more recent collections. So this was from the 21S, just a summer runway collection from last year, which is so recent. And it is the loveliest. I'm gonna do some close-up shots, but just from afar, look how lovely and drapey this top is. I also tried on the short sleeve version of this top, which also was so beautiful and very Balmain-esque because it had these really beautiful shoulder pads. I didn't take it because there was a tiny little defect that was already on the fabric, but otherwise I would have loved that one too. But I'm glad that this one also fits me super well. And oh my goodness, look at the details. This is silver appliques and I think it's stuck on the fabric because I don't know how else they do it, um, but it feels pretty solid and um, still solid but very delicate at the same time there are also pearls all over the flower appliques and little petals that are 3d this is like the most delicate fabric ever though because it's really thin and really airy like super airy and i had no idea what it was until i looked at the tag and it's actually silk but it's silk with elastane so it has a bit of a stretch and it's just the most wonderful drapey top ever. I'm usually a 34 or a 36 inch Chanel, and this was um, just the right amount of flow that doesn't um, look overwhelming, like it's not too big, but it also doesn't pinch in any bad areas. But yeah, this top was expensive. Before tax, it was 4,050, and luckily there was 40% off, so even after tax, it was still, it was still very expensive. It was still well over 2700. So yes, this is definitely a splurge, but I couldn't I couldn't not take it home simply because that day I was wearing my beautiful skirt. It's one of my favorite skirt to wear especially during these transitional weather when it's still sort of cool, but it's getting warmer and I belted it with my Chanel belt, of course. And I also wore my Chanel jacket. And I tried on a number of different tops and dresses. And the ones that really blew my mind were the two tops that was in this design. I tried to look for pictures of this top from the runway and I could only find the long sleeve version. So I'm gonna put a picture of when it was featured on the runway. But this picture definitely did not do justice to how beautiful and how luxurious and how delicate this top really is. Even the little hook in the back has a Chanel little logo. Flowers, there's smaller ones, bigger ones. It's really, really beautiful. And the drape is just this kind of drapiness and the material lightness and just the, um, just how like one top can make your whole outfit is what makes the big difference between ready to wear and high street clothes. So I'm gonna change into this top and I'm gonna walk you through the rest of my vlog where you can see some of the stuff that was on sale that day. There we have it. Oh my goodness, guys. Isn't it so... Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. The moment I put it on, I didn't want to love it because it was very, you know, it was very pricey. Uh, but it's just so beautiful and so, like, luxurious feeling. Like, it's very delicate, yes, but that's where the luxe feel comes in. It's, like, so delicate and so refined that you feel like, wow. 
I, I, I look like a million bucks. On top of that, it's such a versatile top. Yes, it looks very girly and elegant and uh, feminine right now, but I tell you, I tried it with shorts, I tried it with jeans, it looks lovely. You better believe that I'm gonna make the most out of it. I'm gonna wear it all summer long because it's such a light fabric and apparently we're gonna get a couple of heat waves over the summer, so I look forward to just wearing the heck out of this, but also be able to um, just look super lovely for a date night. The other one that I said that I loved had kind of these really cool shoulder pads, not too big, but they were definitely prominent and they were short sleeve. That one was also just as lovely, the same drape and it looked amazing with the same outfit except that it had a little tiny snag right here so I was devastated I didn't take it home but at least this one fits and I I love a good sleeveless top anyway I also tried this really beautiful velvet tube dress and I loved it it was a size too big it was a size 38 I know that I can always alter it but I decided against it just because it's a velvet fabric even though it was a summery kind of dress but it was velvet fabric so I just decided against it even though I loved it I was also told that there was a top version the crop top version of that same fabric but I totally missed out apparently they only had one and another customer already grabbed it aside from that I also tried um, another little tank top that one was probably cotton like a ribbed cotton it was okay it was cute but i didn't take that home there were also a bunch of different dresses there is a lot more on the floor i didn't end up trying every single thing obviously
I mean, look at this beautiful top. Don't mind the tags, I will cut it off. <laughs> but oh my gosh, look at the beautiful detailing on it and how it just makes the whole outfit. Minus the top and the shoes, this was pretty much the outfit that I wore to Chanel the other day. I wore this beautiful skirt that I love. I'm gonna have it linked down below. Uh, I don't normally wear heels when I have to walk and stuff, but I did wear my Echo shoes. And of course I had my beautiful belt from the current season and my heart bag, which I wore for the first time that day. And you see why I love this top so much now, right? It literally makes the whole outfit. It literally makes the outfit. <laughs> because it's quite delicate in the front with all the beadings and all the appliques, I don't think I will be wearing any heavier jackets on top. Even the jacket I was wearing that day is too heavy to, to like, you know, potentially ruin the front. So I will probably just be wearing like a little cardigan or maybe like a silk, um, like a silk scarf or something if I was really cold that day. So I hope that you enjoyed and appreciated this vlog because as I mentioned many times before, I'm unable to vlog in the luxury stores because they don't allow it. And the only way I was able to obtain these footages is because I was inside my own dressing room trying on things. So there's a little bit of footage at least so you get to see a little bit of eye candy and also Really, really glad that I found something that I love. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. If you want to support me further, you can also join my channel membership where you get more exclusive content, or you can just buy me a coffee when off. I'll have all the links down below. Thanks so much. Have a great day, and I'll talk to you guys again very soon. Bye.